Hello students, I hope you are doing beautiful mathematics. In this video, I will teach you a very interesting concept from combinatorics. It's called complementary counting. Now, we will learn this concept using a problem that came up in American Math Competition 8. So let's first understand the problem and then we will go into the concept. The problem says that you have to choose five distinct integers from 1 to 10. Five distinct integers from 1 to 10. And then you have to choose five distinct integers from 11 to 20. So in total, you are choosing 10 integers. Five from 1 to 10, five from 11 to 20. There is one condition do. No two numbers can differ by exactly 10. Which basically means that if you are selecting the number 5 from 1 to 10, you cannot select the number 15 from 11 to 20. You have to choose some other number. No two numbers... No two numbers differ by exactly 10. Now the question is this. What is the sum of the 10 chosen numbers? Now you might think that how can we even do this? We don't know which numbers are being chosen. How can we find the sum of the numbers? Well, let's think carefully and we will see how to do it. And we will use something called complementary counting. So suppose the numbers A, B, C, D and E are chosen from 1 to 10. Now we have no control over which five numbers are chosen. Suppose the numbers which are not chosen are X, Y, Z, W and R. Now one thing is for sure. These 10 numbers are the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We do not know which is which. But we know that these numbers are those 1, 2, 3, 4 up to 10 numbers. Okay. Now let's figure out what numbers we cannot choose from 11 to 20. We cannot choose 10 plus A, 10 plus B, 10 plus C, 10 plus D and 10 plus E. We are restricted to choose them. Because if we choose that, then th there will be two chosen numbers whose difference is exactly 10. Then which are the numbers that we can choose? Well, we can choose 10 plus X, 10 plus Y, 10 plus Z, 10 plus W and 10 plus R. These are the numbers that we can choose. Okay, so first we chose the numbers A, B, C, D, E from 1 to 10. Then our hands get tied. We cannot do anything else but choose these remaining five numbers from 11 to 20. And we want to find out the sum of all the chosen numbers. So, what are the chosen numbers? A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus 10 plus X plus 10 plus Y plus 10 plus Z plus 10 plus W plus 10 plus R. Now notice that we already know what is A, B, C, D, E, X, Y, Z, W, R. These are, we do not know which is which, but these 10 numbers are the numbers from 1 to 10. So we can simply write that this is 1 plus, 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10. These 10 numbers are after all those 10 numbers. And we have 5 additional 10s. 
so 50 we are done you can just compute the sum of these 10 numbers add it to 50 and you will get the final answer so this part i will give it to you as a challenge can you compute this and put the final answer in the comment section thank you for watching this video if you like interesting problems in mathematics then you can consider subscribing to our channel if you are interested in mathematical olympiads physics olympiad computer science olympiad or research projects in school then check the link in the description we have some wonderful programs for that all the best i'll see you in the next video bye